Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome to the Nine Miles As Seen on TV Gadget and Food Review. Today I'm going to do another liquid death review. This time it's the Mango Chainsaw. Naturally flavored sparkling water. I did a liquid death review a few days ago and it was actually pretty good. So I decided to go to the store and get another flavor. This is the Mango Chainsaw. What a name. And this is kind of like, they're going to teach marketing courses on this company. They use influencer, influencers. They use clever uh, packaging everything so this is a uh, kind of beer can inspired I guess and it all it is is sparkling water and I think it used to just be like a, a I think it was a spring water then they moved into sparkling water and now they're getting the flavors so this company keeps expanding I got it at my local supermarket but this is the mango chainsaw it was on sale for a dollar says murder your thirst and that is their company I guess tagline 6.9 ounces what separates this from other bottled water, I guess, and like, you know, sparkling waters is there's actually calories in this. So it has carbonated mountain water, <laughs> carbonated mountain water, agave nectar, natural mango flavor, citric acid, orange extract, natural flavor. And so natural flavor that, that usually can hide a lot of different flavorings. It's always interesting. Manufac manufactured for Liquid Death Mountain Water, Los Angeles, California. We donate 10% of the profits from every can sold to help kill plastic pollution. And their hashtag is Death to Plastic. Contains 0% juice. This ruthlessly tall boy of flavored sparkling water is armed with agave and natural electro lights to refresh your body and murder your thirst. And so I first found out about this brand on Instagram, uh, Burt Kreischer. I didn't even think he was sponsored at the time. Now he is. Now he gets. He has like an ad for them. But Burt Kreischer, who's a comedian, uh, was a big <laughs> fan endorser of Liquid Death. And I guess if you have all the money to burn, you can do that too. You can drink water out of a cool can. All right, so here we go. Let's open it up, see what's inside. How does this taste? And actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna be on camera so you can get get my actual reaction. So here we go. All right. So hopefully the audio sounds okay. I actually bought a new microphone, so hopefully it sounds a little bit better. Here we go. Except for there's a dishwasher in the background, but uh, Liquid Death Mango Chainsaw. How does it taste? Is this gonna be delicious? Will I be getting this all the time from this day forward? We'll see. Here we go. Three, two, one. Liquid Death. So I had the lime orange last time, and that's that actually I liked. Uh, this kind of has a more, it's definitely more on the orange side, so less of kind of like that, uh, you know, that nice bite of the lime, uh, and more of just kind of that rap mellow orange taste. And then you get that, it's not too overly carbonated, but you get a little bit of that crisp carbonation taste. Um, I think I like the, the lime uh, the lime one better. Um, this one's good though. I mean, it's definitely, I would say better than just a standard sparkling water. If you just get water, sparkling water, this is definitely better. You can taste the sweetness, so you can taste that 20 calories. It definitely has a sweetness, the agave nectar. Yeah, it's not bad. Um, yeah, if I had to rate it, sparkling, as sparkling waters go, I think it's kind of in a product category of its own. But as sparkling waters go, I'd give it like a, I don't know, like a 7.5, 8 out of 10. It's pretty good. I think I would give the, I mean, I'd definitely give the, the lime one that I had like an 8 out of 10. So I'll, I'll give this one like a 7.5. If you like that orange flavor, you know, I've never been like a fan of like crushed soda or something, so I, I don't really like that kind of artificial orange taste. Um, it's not my favorite thing, but some people might like it. I prefer kind of like a citrusy, crisp lime over the, you know, the, the orange type taste. But if you like that, I would say go for this one over the lime, even though it is mango, technically. Um, it just has, to me, it tastes like an orange, something like an orange, orangey flavor. 
But yeah, this is a product ca category all of its own because it does have calories, um, but it's kind of competing with sparkling uh, water, but also maybe soda. Um, you definitely want to confuse with the soda, but it does have a little bit of sweetness, which is different than your standard uh, sparkling water. So yeah, Liquid Death, I mean, another good one. Um, yeah, if you want to try it out, I'd say go for it. It won't break the bank at, this was on sale for 99 cents. You'll probably pay a little bit more, but yeah, not bad. So thanks for watching everyone. If I've ever saved you money, please, please, please consider supporting me on Patreon. That's patreon.com slash nine malls, patreon.com slash nine malls. Search the number nine, M-A-L-L-S. And I've moved kind of like, or I'm producing content that's kind of weird and strange and strange items strange food items there'll be kind of strange gadgets things like that and i'm moving that to patreon i'm trying to dif differentiate the content on patreon that gives you a reason to go over there and support my channel i mean if you just want to support me that's great but if you want to get exclusive content that's kind of on the more strange bizarre type into the spectrum of food and gadgets definitely become a member of patreon.com it won't break the bank. It's a dollar on up. You can support me for a dollar. It's really easy. Sign up literally takes seconds if you're already a member. So go over there, patreon.com slash nine malls. And also please like, subscribe, and continue watching. So thanks for watching, everyone. Till next time, I'll see you later.